Hey guys, it's Allison and I'm here with a video for my December Daily. It's my title page. <clears throat> so, I kind of just wanted to do something for my December Daily, so I decided to just do this. <laughs> um, so, I'm just pulling up my fuse because I knew I wanted to use that. And um, I decided to use one of these 2x2 two two, um, pockets pages. <laughs> 2x2x12? Two by two by I don't know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. So now I'm looking through my stuff, and um, this isn't all of the stuff, and I have it differently organized now, but I do plan on doing a video going through my items for December Daily. I just don't have all of it yet, because I keep buying more, because I have a problem. So yeah. Um, so I decided to just look through my ephemera until I found something that spoke to me. And so I liked this little tag, not tag, little piece um, that I cut down to a square that says, Tis the season. And that was from the Chamel collection. Um, so then I just began to pull out items from that collection because I decided that that's what I wanted to go with. And I just used one of these um, squares from the Pinkfresh Studios collection Christmas wishes or whatever I can't remember but um just a measure to cut down because I didn't want to remove the pieces of paper from the paper pad <laughs> so um then I decided to put these thickers that are from the Chamel collection as well onto this piece of paper and it does get changed a bunch so yeah <laughs> get ready for it I guess <laughs> um so now I am moving it because <laughs> <clears throat> I kind of like realized what pattern I wanted to do and then I'm just going through these chipboard stickers I'm going to admit I really don't love the way that these are packaged <laughs> I don't know I just I don't know I know American Crafts packages their chipboard stickers like this now, but it's just kind of annoying because once you remove them once, you have to like constantly stick them back in or else the like stickers go everywhere and they're just annoying. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, so I go with one of these snowflakes from the Chamel collection and I just like stick it right on there because that's how I roll, I guess. And then I was kind of trying to figure out my letter situation for, obviously I wanted to say... December Daily 2015. So I decided to cut out a couple more pieces of paper, which you cannot see me doing, but I'm using this, um, what's the word? Um, Christmas lights paper. And then I think, I thought I wanted to use these letters from the Pink Fresh Studios collection, which were really I don't know. I don't want to say bad quality, but they were just really hard to get off that sheet, and the sheet was, like, falling apart in some places and not cut in other places, so I don't know what the deal with that was. But whatever machine they used, obviously, did was, like, on the fritz or something for my sheet. So I thought I wanted that one to say 2015, um, but then I started to use it, or not 20, I think I put daily on there. Anyway, I started to use it, and it just looked funny to me, so I removed it. And now I decided to use a piece of this vellum from the Schmel collection, which I cut funny. <laughs> so I had to cut it down a little bit. So it's a little bit too small for the square. But I don't really think in the end that you can tell that much. Um, so yeah, this is me trying to write daily on here. And I just like don't end up liking the way that it looks. And so I take it off. And then I get out the other thickers. And I'm like, oh, no, that doesn't look good. And then I try to put them on this one. And I still didn't like it. And then... <laughs> You'll see. And then I'm like, hmm, should I put 2015 on here? And then I'm like, no. Red 2015 on the Christmas lights. And then um, my video stopped recording, so I'm sorry. But you'll see what I did there with the letters. And then I added some sequins, and I added, and I moved everything around. And then I added a, that circular piece is from the Pink Fresh Studios collection. Um, this little Christmas tree, I think, is from the, like, Project Life stuff, I think. The Project Life kit that I got, and then the background paper is also from the Miss Chamel collection. Sorry if my voice is funny, I'm still a little bit sick. Um, it's almost gone, but, 
I want to keep up with this schedule of putting up oh, uploading videos daily just because I do a ton of filming although I have not filmed recently so we'll see but I don't know if it'll actually continue daily after October because there's no October daily but in December it should go back to daily and anyway, I use a tiny word sticker from the pink fresh studios collection and then I use some enamel dots from the my mind's eye collection and then I decided to use another one of these chipboard stickers which is really hard to get in there they're hard to get in there when they're big from the Chamel collection um and I use those like suitcases and presents I don't really know what suitcases have to do with my life because we're not really traveling anywhere for Christmas we I don't know what's happening <laughs> we do my husband's family lives close to Brooks where we used to live like part of their family. his mom his mom <laughs> and stepdad and siblings live in that area so we do go out there, but they're going away this year for Christmas, so I think we're going to do Christmas with them in, like, November. So I might just, like, have one day of November in my December daily as, like, a Christmas thing. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll just include it in my project life or, like, do some spreads or something. I'm not really sure. Anyway, that other thing that says tis the season, I'm now realizing just now that it says tis the season twice on this, which is going to kind of make me angry, but honestly, I probably won't change it. <laughs> Maybe I will, but... That piece is from the Seven Paper Felix collection, like little plastic ephemera thing. And this little Joy is from the Pink Fresh Studios collection. And I wanted to use one of these tiny word stickers, but it just didn't work. And then I used more of these enamel dots. <clears throat> and that piece of paper was also from the Chamel collection. And then I was just trying to figure out something else to put up in this top right corner. Um, for a bit I thought I wanted another circle up there, but then I felt like that was too many circles and I wanted it to kind of look random, but not completely. I don't know. Anyway, I find this skate, which doesn't really have anything to do with my life because honestly we probably will not go skating, but I decided to use it because it's from the Chanel collection and it matched the colors and skating, winter, you know. Then I use my fuse and then I do put like a doily and some stuff on the back, but... Uh, you'll just see that in the pictures, but there is a close-up. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm really excited for December Daily. Um, please like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you soon. Bye!